Well, that loss for Qingdao last night leaves them at 0-6 on the season. That's a far cry from the expectations many placed on the club after they brought in former seven-time NBA All-Star Tracy McGrady. Their 30-point loss last night was the latest setback for the Eagles. But despite their struggles, T-Mac is taking it in stride, and he remains committed to getting things turned around in Qingdao. As Tracy McGrady and his teammates walked back to the locker room on Friday night, they did so as the only 0-6 team in the Chinese Basketball Association. McGrady has quickly found out, through no fault of his own, that he is the star of stars and what amounts to a one-man squad at the moment. Stuck with a weak supporting cast, McGrady is shouldering the responsibility for the Eagles' offensive output. He has done an admirable job so far, averaging almost 25 points per game, and T-Mac hopes his play will begin to rub off. You know, I, I want to really give back some of the knowledge that I have for the game of basketball and help these guys become better basketball players. And, uh, you know, hopefully, you know, when I leave here, they understand the game a lot more and approach the game um, in a different way that they are now. Despite his club's rough start to the new season, T-Mac says he's happy to be a mentor, building on the popularity he gained while playing alongside Chinese icon Yao Ming in Houston. McGrady has a die-hard fan base here in China who will support him regardless of how Qingdao does this year. He's the god in our heart, forever our idol. This has nothing to do with the Qingdao team. He's the one I love. No matter how the team plays or if the losing continues, I will support him. When McGrady signed the most celebrated contract in CBA history back in September, he stated his goal was to bring a championship to Qingdao, a club who has never made the postseason. Despite their struggles, T-Mac says his aim remains the same. Yeah, I won't lose that. I won't lose that. Um, you know, I came over here and make these guys better basketball players, and uh, you know that's that's going to be uh, my job to uh, to do that. You know, until I leave. Um, you know, they're going to be, be better basketball players before I leave. Uh, make sure of that, and uh, they're going to understand the game and understand how to approach the game. I have to be upbeat, and I have to have a positive attitude. Many did expect McGrady to step in and instantly copy the success that Stefan Marbury has enjoyed in Beijing. But what's easy to forget is that Marbury started his career slowly as well in China, with failed stints in Changxi and Foshan before he found a home in the capital. There is still time for the Eagles and McGrady to turn their season around and could find a boost if they find the right foreign replacement for the departing DJ Mabanga. However, it's becoming clear that even with all T-Mac brings, he can't do it himself. And if Qingdao is unable to bring in some help, the club may see a boost in attendance by the end of the season. But they will fall short of McGrady's goal of chasing a championship here in China.